If you've got the Radio Master Zorro with the internal Express LRS module, you're going to need to flash your configuration to it as well as keep it up to date. This process is actually really simple and very user friendly and it can be done in under two minutes. In this video, we're going to cover the three methods for flashing Express LRS to your Radio Master Zorro. The first two are for setting up your initial configuration and the third is for keeping it up to date. If you're new to Express LRS, the first thing you're going to need to do is download the configurator from the Express LRS GitHub. This part is really simple, just download the right one for your operating system. So the first thing we're going to need to do is power on our Radio Master Zorro and then connect the USB-C cable to the top USB-C port as that's the one we use for data. Now from here we're going to select USB debugging which is going to allow us to use EdgeTX pass-through to flash the internal module. So head into the ExpressLRS configurator and select the most recent version. Keep in mind that if you have receivers already flashed with ExpressLRS, they need to be running version 2.0 or higher in order to be compatible with the most recent version 2 release. Now we're going to head down to Target and we're going to select Radio Master and then we're going to select Zorro. We now need to select EdgeTX Pass-Through as the flashing method. You now need to select the regulatory domain. If you're in Europe or any other part of the world that requires radios to have LBT or listen before talk, then select the EU regulatory domain. If you're anywhere else in the world, just select ISM 2.4 GHz. You now need to go and put in all of your settings and the default settings tend to work best in most situations. The key things that you want to customize here are your binding phrase and your Wi-Fi codes. Now the binding phrase is really handy because it allows a transmitter and a receiver that share the same binding phrase to automatically be bound so when you power them on for the first time they're good to go. Now we're going to select and enter our home Wi-Fi network as well as Wi-Fi password and the reason for that is when we go to update our radio the transmitter module when we enter Wi-Fi mode will automatically connect to our home network and it just makes updating it really really simple. If you're doing this for the first time it may take a little longer than two minutes because it is going to need to download the Express LRS GitHub repository onto your computer. Once that's all done, you're going to see a success message and you're good to go. Flashing over Wi-Fi for your initial configuration is slightly different. The first thing we're going to need to do is go into the Express LRS configurator, select the latest firmware, the target being the Radio Master Zorro. We're going to select Wi-Fi. From here, what we're also going to do is set up the parameters the same way as we did for USB, but instead of clicking build and flash, we're now going to click build. And after that build process is complete, there is going to be a window that opens with a firmware file. Drag that firmware file to your desktop to make it really easy to find for the next step in the process. Now from here, we're going to go back into our Radio Master Zorro. We're going to go into the Express LRS Lua script. Bear in mind that the Zorro does come with both the V1 and V2 Lua script, so you are going to need to select the Lua script that says Express LRS. From here, we're going to scroll down to Wi-Fi connectivity, select enable Wi-Fi, enter for Wi-Fi update. What this is going to do is create a Wi-Fi hotspot from your radio, kind of like how you Wi-Fi hotspot from your phone. Head into your computer and look for the Wi-Fi network to appear in the list of available networks and you'll see ExpressLRS TX. Select that network and enter the Wi-Fi password being ExpressLRS in lowercase. Now we're going to head into our browser and we're going to enter in 10.0.0.1 and that's going to connect directly to your ExpressLRS radio. We're going to click choose file and select the firmware file we dragged to our desktop earlier and click update. This is going to upload that file over Wi-Fi to your transmitter and then it's going to flash it. You'll know this is complete when you get both a success message in your web browser as well as the Wi-Fi update screen on the radio disappearing. We're now going to use the Wi-Fi method for keeping our radio up to date. Bear in mind you don't actually need to do this every time there's a new release. So for example when we go from 2.1.1 to 2.1.2 you really don't need to do that incremental upgrade if everything's working for you. Once we move to major releases such as from version 1 to version 2 then you want to make sure you go in and update everything. So like before we're going to head back into the Express LRS configurator. I'm going to select the most recent version and then select the Radio Master Zorro from our target. Now I'm going to select Wi-Fi as our method of flashing. I'm going to make sure all of our configuration settings are correct. The key difference here is we're now going to head into our Radio Master Zorro and like we did before with our initial configuration, I'm going to go back into the Lua script, hit Wi-Fi connectivity, 
hit enable Wi-Fi. In the previous step for our initial configuration, we loaded our home network on it. And what this is now gonna do is the Wi-Fi chip inside of our radio is gonna to connect to our home network. If we did this correctly previously, you'll actually see the device appear in your network devices tab. And under Wi-Fi, it's actually gonna pre-select that. If all of that's correct, you can now hit build and flash. When it comes to updating a transmitter module, I just hit build and flash inside of the configurator. If you have any questions or you are having any issues, drop them in the comments below and I'll do what I can to help. I'm Darren from Everything Micro FPV. Until next time, don't forget to send it.